One day, you could have superhuman vision. Play your favorite albums in your head and download your brain to a computer or even to another body. Oh, it's alive. It's alive. It's alive. Though this may sound like an episode of your favorite science fiction show, Elon Musk and his team at the neural tech startup Neuralink believe that their electronic brain-computer interfaces could make this possible. Described as Fitbit in your skull with tiny wires. A Fitbit in your skull with tiny wires. The small, easy-to-install brain-computer interface could be used to expand the capabilities of humans, changing the way we interact with technology and treat neural and mobility issues. Yet the goals of the company speaks to a potential problem in the future, artificial intelligence. Musk has been very vocal about his fear of artificial intelligence, believing AI could one day overshadow the human race. Musk's inevitable transhumanist goal of augmenting intelligence and abilities may be necessary if we are to compete with advanced artificial intelligence. However, Neuralink's team still has a long way to go before the emergence of AI-human hybrids. The tech company still has a lot of bureaucratic, ethical, and technological hurdles to cross. If Musk's companies accomplish half of what they claim, we could see the emergence of one of the most significant technologies in human history. But how does it work? Simply put, Neuralink is a technology that can help humans interact with machines using their brains. The company's eventual aim is to further develop brain-computer interfaces to the point where one can be installed in a doctor's office. Let's say you opted in to go in for a Neuralink procedure. What would that look like? Neuralink wants to make the installation of your brain-computer interface painless and quick, as easy as LASIK surgery. The design has changed significantly and now resembles a small coin around 8 millimeters in diameter, which houses electrodes that are about 1 20th the thickness of a strand of hair. To install the Neuralink, a tiny piece of skull is removed and the Neuralink is slotted in to sit flush with the skull. Since this process needs to be extremely precise, the Neuralink team has created a robot specifically for this procedure. The entire process could take less than an hour while you are under partial anesthesia. Installing the device will only leave a tiny scar and include all the sensors one would expect in a smartwatch. Once installed, the device will be able to send and receive electrical signals through your brain and use these to control machines. In its early stages, it could allow control of basic devices like a computer and other smart devices. 